Hey friends, this is Atif Hope you're well and welcome to the new update on Ocean Protocol. In today's video, we will once again take a look at this big breakout from this huge falling wedge pattern. But after the breakout, the price line is still moving sideways above this support. And on the daily time frame chart, by the way, we have a quite big development and it has broken out this descending, a quite big descending triangle as well. But before starting this analysis, if you're not subscribed to my channel, then do subscribe it. And for more ideas, you can also join me and support me as a YouTube member or as a Patreon member because here I'm sharing different trading ideas for you. And you can find the link to join me here in the video description I've shared. So let's start the analysis. And first of all, let me begin with my last trade setup of Ocean Protocol with you that I shared with my members. And that was a, an expected harmonic bullish reversal cipher pattern. And by the way, before that, I shared this breakout uh from a falling wedge pattern you can see that the price line broke out a falling wedge pattern on the four hour time frame chart and after playing this chart we can see that the price line rallied very well and after hitting the sell target on even rallied beyond the final tar uh, sell target that i've defined as for the uh breakout from this falling wedge pattern uh the price line is again moved down now if we take a look at the recent one then this was a quite perfect formation of the cipher pattern and we were very close to complete this final leg of the cipher therefore i told my members that we can expect some more drop in order to complete this final leg of the cipher and from here we can buy and this is the sell target zone that i've defined as for the fibonacci sequence of the cipher pattern for my members and after playing this chart we can see that this time we were really very close to complete this cipher pattern but could not complete it we dropped uh until here but uh from here we had a powerful reversal move and you can see it uh reversed very well but could not complete this final leg of the cipher now if we take a look at this uh, weekly time frame chart then here we have uh different chart patterns like previously it formed a very big descending triangle on the uh, on the weekly time frame chart and after the breakout uh it uh, rallied very well that was by the way quite big pump and after that it formed another falling wedge pattern and after uh, after the breakout we had another very nice pump and this time it has formed another falling wedge pattern on the same weekly time frame chart but after the breakout you can see for the past several weeks a month it is moving sideways above this support of 15 cents and you can see this is a quite long-term support here we uh, had this level working as a strong resistance back in september 2019 and now you can see for the past several weeks it is working as a very very strong support our next uh, key resistance by the way is here at 34 cents and you can see that here we got rejected by this resistance and here it was working as a support here it was working as a support in fact it was a very very huge a uh, double bottom pattern above this support of 34 cents then we had this very powerful pump and before that here we also had another double bottom formation at the support and then we had another very very nice and powerful pump and therefore we need to break it out in order to continue this move to the outside now if we take a look at the daily time frame chart here we have a quite big development you can see it was moving inside this uh, descending triangle since 9th of june 2022 we had several touch points at the support, several touch points at the resistance as well. But after several attempts, you can see finally we have broken out this resistance of the descending triangle a few days back here on 18th of October. And since then, we are moving sideways here. Now, if we take a look at the target for this breakout, then after the breakout, our target to the upside is here that will be approximately at 30 cents or 31 cents and in that situation you can see we can also uh, reach very close to this key resistance that we have at 34 cents and after breaking out this resistance our target for this bigger breakout from from this bigger falling wedge pattern is here at the top of the wedge that will be approximately at one dollar and thirty cents so this was the update so far i hope that you've liked the analysis and do hit the like and do subscribe to the channel as well and for more ideas you can also join me and support me as a youtube member or as a patreon member because here i'm sharing different trading ideas for you and you can find the link to join me here in the videos description i've shared take care goodbye